and the star of the show today is Ozzy. And today we're doing actually a live video, so I want to welcome everyone from home to join us as well. Uh, thank you guys for watching us at the Lion Habitat Ranch. Ozzy will be painting a t-shirt today, hopefully. Is that right, Ozzy? Yeah. I think he is ready to work. So Ozzy here is a reticulated giraffe. He is a male. Uh, he is six years old. Uh, Ozzy came to us when he was around seven to eight months old and he was already eight feet tall. He came to us from a facility in Kansas. Maybe he doesn't want to paint with red. Let's switch to gold. And uh, they already had a male giraffe. Uh, so uh, male giraffes can't live together. Uh, so we had space, so we took him. And he's been happy here ever since. Uh, painting for Ozzy is a very uh, mind stimulating thing. So uh, it keeps him occupied. He enjoys it very much. I don't think he likes red today. He didn't like red earlier. And uh, he didn't want to paint with the red brush. Ready, Ozzy? He's supposed to stick out his tongue for me and let me know when he's ready to paint. He's not supposed to paint uh, with food in his mouth because we don't want to end up with extra texture on that canvas or t-shirt. So he does have a long, beautiful black tongue. You want to try one more time, Ozzy? Might have slipped out. There you go. That long black tongue of his is a special adaptation for him because he eats for around 18 hours a day, up to 20 sometimes. So he wants to make sure that tongue is protected from sunlight. So that dark pigment on his tongue acts as a natural UV resistant. Getting a sunburn on your tongue would be really bad. No amount of aloe vera would cure that. Whenever you're ready, Ozzy. Yeah, there you go. So that tongue of his can grow one inch for every foot of giraffe. Ozzy will let us know how tall he is in a minute. I'll ask him. So Ozzy, how tall are you? Good job, bud. So if you notice, he did go all the way up to that 16 foot mark. Uh, Ozzy is not full grown yet. He can grow another couple of feet. Uh, he weighs around 18 to 2,000 pounds right now. When he's full grown, he can weigh up to 3,000 pounds. Our largest lion on property is around 600 pounds. So you might be wondering if Ozzy feels comfortable living here with 31 lions. Ozzy doesn't really mind. He understands he's a lot larger than they are. He actually will sleep lying down. Giraffes don't sleep lying down in the wild. Uh, it leaves them vulnerable to lions and uh, other predators. So Ozzy knows he's comfortable. He does have a bed right here behind him on his left. There are a few uh, predators besides lions in the wild that prey on them. Uh, humans. Humans are one of them, uh, unfortunately. Uh, crocodiles do get them too as while they're trying to drink water. A 3,000 pound crocodile can pull a giraffe into the Nile. Ozzy has a very important role in the savanna, helping out all the other animals out there. He acts as a sentinel. It's like a giant turret that stands out in the savanna. Other animals will follow him around. And uh, if a giraffe sees something, he'll see it a lot sooner than other animals. Good job, Oz. And that lets all the other zebra, gazelle, and wildebeest around know that something's coming if a giraffe gets freaked out. It gives them a little early warning. So he helps everyone out by being a sentinel of the savanna. He also has a very important role here in captivity. He acts as an ambassador animal to other giraffes. A lot of people don't know it, but giraffes are going through what you call a silent extinction. A silent extinction is uh, basically... I'm gonna try again. Good job. A silent extinction is just something no one knows about. Uh, everyone knows about uh, elephants and rhinos, but they don't know much about uh, giraffes. Giraffes are actually going extinct. 80% uh, of their population has been on a decline in the last 20, 30 years. So it's very important to get that out there. So Ozzy wants you all to know what's going on with this species. So the proper way to shoot a giraffe is with a camera. 
very important for Ozzy. He's very uh, popular on social media, as you can see Denise. He's doing a live video. Uh, he's also popular on Tinder, if you guys want to look him up. <laughs> A little bit more gold, Ozzy. You guys want to know a fun fact about giraffes? Um, anyone want to guess how many vertebrae they have in their neck since their neck is so long? How many? 40? It's a lot less than that. I'll give you guys a hint. It's about the same amount we have in our necks. A little more than five. He's about seven. seven. Perfect. Seven. Uh, actually, it's the exact same amount of vertebrae as we have. A lot of mammals have the same amount as we do. Um, it's just his are a lot larger, and they're on like a ball and socket joint, so it allows him to have a lot more maneuverability in his neck to get all those event points in the trees. If you guys did want to see what he does to trees, you can see right up behind Denise over here. All the trees down this road is mulberry trees. Those are his wonderful topiary skills at work right there. He does have a lot of other skills. He does interior designing if he gets the brush. He does hair streaking if Caroline's not paying attention. He also likes to do fingernails. Ozzy does have a lot of um, other artwork he works on. He does hats, scarves, t-shirts, keychains. We call it all Jungle Wear by Ozzy. And you can find it inside the gift shop or online. Huh, Ozzy. So since he is a six-year-old giraffe, we do like to keep these uh, painting sessions short and sweet to keep his attention. So we'll do a couple more strokes, then we'll call this session complete. Do bunches of bunches of. If you guys do hear that clicking sound, that's me. That's just letting Ozzy know uh, what he's going to get rewarded for. And when I click, it's when he strokes, so he knows he's getting treats for painting. Because sometimes, if you guys did notice, he did drop the brush or something. If I clicked when he dropped the brush, he would think, oh, it's good to drop the brush, I'll get rewarded for that. So it's very important to click at the right moment. A little bit more red, a little bit more red. When you're ready. Yeah. He is an abstract artist, so sometimes you do have to look for the hidden meaning in his artwork. Sometimes he does like to hide a little Ozzy in there somewhere. Good job, Oz. I think they're enjoying it. So if you guys did enjoy Ozzy's painting demonstration, you give him a really big round of applause. He enjoys that. Good job, Oz. Do you want to take a bow? Good job, buddy. If you guys are interested in seeing any of his artwork inside that gift shop, we do have water. I know it's hot, so sometimes it's complimentary. You just got to ask Sean inside. Um, just keep in mind, we do want one family in at a time due to um, everything that's going on in the environment, like COVID and stuff. So keep everyone safe, keep animals safe. Thank you guys for joining us.